So now that we actually have our world and have our objects, we need to actually move forward and start programming our Kodu. So the first step that we're going to do is we're actually just going to select Kodu and press program. Now, we're just going to tap when and add when he sees the apple. He's going to move towards it. Now, this isn't Kodu's ultimate goal of, I guess, like eating this apple. All that this is now is when he sees said apple, he's going to move towards it. So we also have to add another line of code in. Our second line of code being when he bumps into the apple, he's going to eat the apple. Now we already have some code working. When I play this code, Kodu is going to move towards and eat these two apples. But you know, Kodu just called me and he told me that he doesn't really like eating green apples. And our code isn't specific enough to make him not eat these green apples. So what we can do is we can actually go back to our existing code in our Kodu and add this in. So now, when he sees an apple that's red because he doesn't like the green apples, he's gonna move towards it. And then when he bumps into that apple that's red, He's going to eat it. So now, lucky for the green apple, the green apple is ignored, and the kodu just moves towards the red apple and eats the red apple. 